since walking into the three-day event, it's opened up a world of opportunities for me that I never even knew existed. I've now taken the leap also to leave full-time employment um, and basically jumped off the edge of the cliff and flying. We have a little newborn and it's allowed us to spend like his first year of life with him rather than um, going back to work straight away. We can now see that we'll have a bit of freedom after retirement. Oh, I predict within the next six to nine months I should be able to leave my day job and actually focus on property full time. Just the sense of knowing that I can do just about anything now. Um, my first deal, um, I made over $100,000 in profit. We've uh, acquired six properties uh, with a total projected profit of close to $500,000. We're looking at yeah, knocking a house down, building two townhouses. Yeah, we're looking at about $200,000 uh, profit from that development. So the property that we've entered into needs a makeover and we expect to, to be able to have that back on the market in in about 12 weeks. The expected profit is, is circa 115000 I've um, done two deals, made around 240000 and probably when I add the extra rental that's come in, it's another 70000 The latest deal, we have just purchased a large block of land in Mount Pritchard, uh, which we're planning to do a subdivision and build four individual houses on. We're hoping to make in excess of $500,000 profit on that one deal. Yeah. One of our current developments is where we've taken a triple block uh, with a house on it and instead of knocking that down and building three new builds, we're going to be a little bit more creative and we're actually going to pick that house up, rotate it around onto one of our blocks and then do two new builds. The benefit of that is that we've increased our profit from $440,000 to $686,000. We have two projects um, in currently in progress with a gross realisation value of about ten and a half million dollars. The expected profit from those is going to be probably around $1.8 million when they complete. Uh, we're currently uh, working on a deal out in the north part of Adelaide. Our profit margin for this particular deal, we're looking at um, about $1.2, $1.3 million profit. The wonderful thing about the DG Institute is that there's a one-stop shop. There's a team of lawyers, a team of financial advisors, brokers and accountants. Within DGI, it's, it's great to have that the people can talk in-house and, and um, structure your deals appropriately and make sure that you're protected um, all the way through the process. And everyone integrates together, so you're working with a, a, a complete team that I didn't have to go and find because Dominique's done it all. The team at DGI Wealth Management have been particularly helpful um, with having, helping us to access our self-managed super fund to be able to use that money to do deals as well. I've also taken advantage of the DGI Finance and uh, had all of our uh, finances looked at and the savings uh, in interest uh, have been unbelievable. That we were happy that we stuck with a DGI finance team and we didn't go ahead with that other personal private finance broker because he just didn't know what we were looking for. We've taken up master wealth control to protect our assets as well. Open Network Funding, they helped us raise the remainder of the funding for settlement. So it was around about $1.5 million. DJI Lawyers, I use them for um, conveyancing, I've used them for doing contracts, for JV agreements. We made an offer which was accepted but didn't exchange on that property till we had the opinion of um, DGI Institute Lawyers. The main advantage of using the DGI Lawyers is that they're on this whole journey, they understand all the complications and if you go to another lawyer or solicitors, you've got to educate them in you know, what sort of a deal we're doing, a joint venture or anything like that, is all new to them. So this team makes it happen quick and efficient. DJI Accounting, I use them for my family trust and my um, unit trusts. They're very, very um, 
accommodating and they work with me to help me to achieve what I want to do. Working with the DGI in-house facilities has made it easier to bring the whole project together so much easier. Like it's just all in the one place. It's so convenient. The community is most supportive I've ever seen. This particular deal I was able to fund through the community and I've been able to um, leverage off different skill sets along the way to be able to get this deal to the table. I think immersing yourself in a supportive community is key because you become the people you're around and if you're around people that are living it, breathing it, doing it, it expands your beliefs in what is possible and what is achievable. It's a network of uh, friends uh, that you can catch up with that all do the same things. There's just so much opportunity and the way in which you can leverage it and the value you can get from it is unlimited. It's really, the only limitation is yourself. Dominique is such a great teacher. She puts some really complicated and messy concepts and lays them out so clear so that you can understand them. You walk away from the three days with all the information you need to make the success of it if you've got the drive to take action. And we can relate to her. Yeah. And she, she Definitely just, relate she's to her. She's very approachable and helpful. Well, I want to say thank you, Dom, because you've changed our lives. The culture of this organisation and the quality of people and the, 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 just the honouring culture, just that you can see it between them. And the integrity. And the integrity is ridiculous. The DGI team, uh, man, they're, they're offering more than I even knew I needed. The best team. Everybody. Amazing. Yeah.